Hi, my name is Dr. Jane Aleem, International Business Coach and Trainer, specialising in working with dentists and dental practice teams just like yours through my businesses Healthy and Wealthy and the Institute of Dental Business. This is the first in a short series of 10 videos that are going to give you tools, tips and techniques that will enable you to make your good practices great. Today's video is called Creating a Compelling Vision. Do you ever get frustrated that your practice has lost its direction or is going in the wrong direction? Do you ever ask yourself, why am I doing this? Or wish that you were treating a different type of patient or doing different types of treatment? If you've answered yes to any of these questions, I can help you. Through the Institute of Dental Business, I've developed a unique coaching and training program that's based on dental anatomy so that we can link how to run a great practice using the learning from dental anatomy. I'd like you to think for a moment about the alveolar bone. As dentists we spend a lot of time looking after the bone in our patient's mouths because the bone is what holds the teeth in place. When it's reduced and compromised our patient's teeth can fall out and any treatment that you do potentially fails. As dentists, we do perio treatment to preserve the bone, prevent bone loss. If we're doing surgicals, we do it in a way that minimises any bone destruction. And if you're doing perio treatment or implant, you probably spend a lot of time augmenting the bone so that your patients have got bone that is of great quality and great quantity. So now what I'd like you to do is think for a moment about your vision for your practice. Think about it like the bone in your patient's mouth. Is it reduced? Is it compromised? Is it of poor quality? Does it have localised defects? Or is your vision for your practice really clear and compelling? Have you communicated it well? Does the vision for your practice hold everything together so that you and your practice can function really well? So some tips to develop your vision. Firstly, get really, really clear about what it is that you want and how you will know you'll get it. Start considering what sort of treatments you want to be doing, what sort of patients that you want to be working with, what do you want your team to be like, what do you want your practice to look like, where do you want your practice to be. Also then, make sure that it's really compelling because as you move on through this journey, times will be tough. Your vision needs to be sufficiently compelling so that when those tough times come, it gets you out of bed in the morning and you remain motivated and excited. Communicate it with your staff and your suppliers, everybody around you that has a part in delivering this vision. Involve them. Developing a compelling vision is one area that many people choose to work with a coach. If you would like to work with me to make your vision really clear and compelling, call me on 01 296 770 462 or email me jane at healthyandwealthy.co.uk and of course join me for my next video which is about time management and planning. Bye for now.